guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're watching The Thing. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are watching John Carpenter's The Thing from 1982. Whew, the 80s and their practical effects were amazing. Um, but I was terrified of a lot of stuff in the 80s. Granted, they weren't really great at doing ratings, and there was some stuff that like were kids' movies that I don't know if they should have been kids' movies. The witches. Um, but uh, I, I feel like this was like probably gonna be one of those things that scared me as a kid. And my father absolutely loved sci-fi. I grew up on sci-fi. He gave me my Star Trek love. My mom gave me my Star Wars love. Therefore, they made the perfect nerd. But I will say that um, horror sci-fi terrified me. I think actually the first horror sci-fi movie I watched was Gremlins. And that was before ratings uh, because it was like a kids movie and it totally was not. <laughs> the second one, a lot of fun. The first one, oh my God, scary, gross. Um, and so I'm expecting this to kind of be in the same realm of like uh, practical effects and where they made everything really dark. So it was like super like mysterious, jump scares maybe. Uh, but I also know that uh, Kurt Russell's in this and he's got a beautiful blowout like Farrah Fawcett hair. <laughs> Not my type, you know, but like I can appreciate a good looking man when I see one in a photo. And, uh, you know, I, I, I think I'm going to like this. Um, I don't know anything about this other than there's a thing and Kurt Russell is in it and John Carpenter directed it or wrote it. I'm not quite sure, but uh, I didn't know until I typed it into the little search that uh, John Carpenter also does Halloween. And those are also movies that I couldn't watch when I was a kid because I was too to Freddy Cat. Um, I know who Michael Myers is, but uh, I've never experienced it. So this will be the first time I've sat down with a John Carpenter movie and gave it my full attention as a big, strong adult who can handle it. I hope. If it lives with me, we're in trouble. But guys, we're not going to know until I watch the movie. So let's go. <laughs> Ooh, Bob Botton. We're gonna find out, or Botton, whatever his name is. We're gonna find out how amazing you are. Man, I haven't watched a movie in a long time that starts with the like, opening credits like this. It shows its age. That's not a problem, I'm just saying. It shows the time period in which it was made for everyone who take that personal. <laughs> Directed by John Carpenter. Directed, didn't write. Oh! Spaceship! See, I wasn't sure if this took place in space or not, but it has a space thing. The thing. Oh, that's dope. That's dope! If that sets the tone, I'm super excited. That was awesome. Antarctica, winter 1982. <sighs> really setting the tone that it's cold. I don't know if it's my air conditioning or what, but I'm like, man, I'm freezing right now. <gasps> Puppy! That dog looks very happy being in that snow. <laughs> it's like when you see a husky in the snow for the first time, or like, in a long time, they're just like, oh, get it all up in my hair. Wait, are, why are they shooting at the dog? Is he like sport hunting? If that's the case, I want his head on a wall. Oh my god, to be a scientist stationed in Antarctica? No thank you. Oh, especially this lively crowd. <laughs> oh my god, is this gonna be me the whole movie going, My god, that's a beautiful man. That is a beautiful man. My move, night to rook three. She the only lady in this whole place who's gotta play chess? <laughs> she got you. <laughs> She's a bitch. Okay. Well, that seems extreme. Okay, not a wild beast. Uh, how about we? Let it! Let it! 
Is he gonna blow up his helicopter now? Yes, and the pilot apparently. Holy shit. What an idiot. No, it's a good boy. Oh! Now you're shooting people! Oh, I don't know if you had to break that window. This guy is a horrible shot. Why is he doing this? Well, now we'll never know. You doing okay, pup? Easy, easy. See, look at how docile the dog is. Guys as crazy as that could have done a lot of damage to their own before they got to us. Nothing we can do about that. Oh, yes, there is. I want to go up. In this weather. Oh. Bennings? Can't condone it much myself, but it is a short haul. An hour there, an hour back. Uh, maybe Shit, wait doc, till the morning? I'll give you the lift. No problem. Forget it, Palmer. Hey, thanks for thinking about it, though. <laughs> well, you're stoned out of your mind, son. Sit down. Those clouds keep moving over the sun, we're gonna get a whiteout. We get caught in that, and you can scratch one doctor and one pilot. This is real thin. It'll clear as soon as you get up. Uh, I'm no expert, but I don't think it's safe either. If the pilot's saying, hey, this isn't a good idea, I don't know, I'll listen to the guy. He might know what he's talking about. Okay, well, the puppy's safe. That's important. What is that hat? <laughs> In a helicopter. <laughs> Are you trying to protect your hair? Keep the rain off your head? <laughs> oh, God. Was there a good reason that they were trying to kill this dog? shot with the shadow. Fade to black! <laughs> okay, if the the dog is bad and that guy was trying to like save everybody, I feel really bad that he got shot in the face. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be laughing when I say it. <laughs> oh, sometimes... That is being wrong is woo, woo. It's a wonderful sign. Oh, oh. Somebody have a here's Johnny moment. Looks recent. Oh. Oh. He killed himself. He did that to his own throat? <laughs> I am so cold right now. Between the set, the sound, the the visual of the snow and like seeing his breath, it's really setting the tone that it's freezing. Hey, Papa, come here. Yeah, 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 take that equipment. It's the start of an igloo? What am I looking at? Okay, the music, though, is really letting me know. Look at this. Oh, God. Oh, why is that person's face like that? Like, that person's face looks like it's missing the lower jaw. Oof. Now, I don't know if it's a shiver from the grotesque or a shiver from the cold or both. Man, I was so, like mad at that guy. I was like, he's trying to kill this puppy. Look at how docile this puppy is. The puppy's perfect. Look at the puppy. Keep an eye on you, pup. Yeah, you. What'd you do with the other guy? Oh, he they brought it with them? Jeez. Oh, I left that thing where it was. That thing. Is it a thing? Is it the thing? Certainly doesn't look human anymore. <laughs> Y'all put on some masks or something. You shouldn't be breathing in charred flesh. I'm telling you, 80s practical effects. Oh! Holy! Was it two people? The dog just watching intently. Okay. 
Oh, okay, the dog either knows something or... I didn't like it either. Well, what we got here is what appears to be, anyway, a normal set of internal organs. Seem to be normal. <laughs> but, as you can see, it is not. That is dope. That is so dope. I know, it's grotesque. It's disgusting. It's disturbing. I love it. Oh, they have more? Go ahead. Go ahead, what are you waiting for? Is he okay? Maybe he's not the problem. Why are all these puppies just lying here? Oh. What was that? <laughs> Oh! 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 It's like a demogorgon! I see where the inspiration came from. Oh, it's like a demo dog. Oh my god. Oh, I'm okay if somebody wants to grenade the dog now. Oh. My. God. Come on, puppy. Get loose. Get loose. You got it. You got it. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I don't want anything to happen to this guy either. You don't have a flashlight or anything? Oh, no. Oh, no. Slam it shut. Slam it shut. Slam it shut. Slam it shut. Oh, my God. That guy looks like he was like a father in a family sitcom, and I don't know which one, but it's bothering me. I could be totally wrong about that, too. Bennings, go get Child. What is this? What's, the kind of What's going on? Oh, we got the high guys <laughs> trying to run around. <laughs> Grab the Mac axe. Mac wants the flamethrower. Mac wants the what? That's what he said. Now move. Flamethrower. <laughs> Y'all shine some lights in there. Come on. Oh, red. Thing is right. Thing is right. <gasps> oh god, kill him! Kill him! Come out of their misery! Brain, go for the brain. You always go for the brain. They're already dead, dude. They're already dead. <gasps> Oh god, he's gonna get out. It's too late for the flamethrower! Oh my god. Damn it, child! Come on! Come on! Child! Get your shit together! Now! Today, Junior, come on! I was gonna say, they're gonna like burn down their entire place. Was that enough? Was, was that enough fire? I don't know if that was enough fire. I mean, I know it's not enough, but, but were there two separate ones? Did the one go up to the ceiling? Are the other dogs that ran away okay? <laughs> <laughs> ASMR for dead crispy bodies. Oh, that's wild. Gross. So gross. You see what we're but talking dope, about at the same time. An organism that imitates other life forms. It imitates, and it imitates other perfectly. life forms. When no, it doesn't. Attacked our dogs that tried to digest them, absorb them. Don't get that away from your mouth. Ugh. How long were you alone with that dog? An hour and a half, maybe. What the hell are you looking at me like that for? Did it bite you? I don't know. It's probably nothing. Well, let's act like it's something and say what it is. No, it's something. So a spaceship crashed and they digged it out of the ice, and whatever was in the ice was the thing. Is that what I'm getting out of it? We can't learn anything from this. Guess not. 
I'm worried about the guy with like the red hair that got shot because the dog like walked past him and he's like, ow, but I don't know if it like bumped him in like the gunshot wound or if it bit him. It looks like something buried under the ice. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a spaceship. You can see the edge. It looks like that. <laughs> Here. This is it. The place where they're spending most of their time. Pretty nasty out, Mac. 35 knots. Screw it. I'm gonna go up anyway. Yeah. I mean, before I was like, ah, better not risk it. And I'm like, God, get the hell out of there. Well, if it was a ship, is there more than one? Like, were there multiple entities aboard the ship? Multiple blocks of ice? <laughs> that hat is so stupid. Dope! I mean, not dope. It's killing people and dogs, but... Spaceship. I love me a spaceship. Oh, getting a closer look. All right, I'm game. See, I love space shit, and I like discovering this stuff. Jesus, how long you figure this has been in the ice? I'd say the ice that's buried in is 100,000 years old, at least. Ooh. Those Norwegians blew it up. Yeah. Perfect place to land, though, to, like, keep people safe. If nobody ever found it, it would have been wonderful. Wait, why is this where they got the ice thing, though? Now, how's this motherfucker wake up after thousands of years in the ice? And how can it look like a dog? I don't know how. Because it's different than us, see? Yeah. Because it's from outer space. What do you want from me? Ask him. You buy any of this, Blair? Uh, <laughs> yes? No? What do you think, buddy? <laughs> oh, okay. But how can you tell the difference between something that's an imitation and something that's real? Because they look the same there. Seventy-five percent. You put that pencil eraser up to your mouth. It could be you. You could have all the cooties. Twenty-seven thousand hours. Yeah, gotta get rid of them. Blow up the whole thing. Take out everyone. We gotta just burn these things. Can't burn the find of the century. That's gonna win somebody the Nobel Prize. <sighs> I hate it, but that's kind of true. Ah. Uh... You uh, got the keys. Get them from Gary. I want to get some stuff out of here. Did he notice that it moved? Oh, it kind of reminds me of the blob. I only briefly remember watching that as a kid, but like I was very scared of like drips because it could be the blob. Let's go, Bennings. I got to get some sleep. Oof. Oh, Bennings. Why would you not react like... Holy shit, and like run out. Windows, please leave. Thank you. I have anxiety. It's Bennix. He's been absorbed. It's funny how Farscape and Doctor Who are slamming into each other right Bennings now in my brain. Right there, Mac. I swear to God, it had a hold of him. Oh, he transformed quick that he can run. It isn't Benning. Nope. Does anyone have a gun? Oh, we're just gonna burn him? We're gonna burn Bennings? I mean, better him than me. It's probably a mercy for the actual Bennings. That's messed up. But I mean, I'm af afraid for Doc, just all like... Or was it Doc or... Blair? 
Yeah, I think Blair was the one that was cutting him up. I'm kind of worried for him, because he's just in a room all by himself. But is somebody else infected, and would we know? What about the, the person that the dog saw at the very beginning with the shadow on the wall? What happened to that person? I don't even know who it was. Twas a dude. And here are many dudes. Wait. Where? Did he just smash something in the helicopter? Oh, Blair. Did you do something bad? Like pop a fuel tank or something? Oh! He's trying to make it to where nobody can leave. Which is smart, because you don't want this to get away. You understand me? It's kind of got the interferes, I'll kill him! Jeez, Blair! He smashed up some of the chopper pretty good. Go see if he got to the tractor. Oh, he's going nuts. He knows too much. He's scared. I'll kill you! Who shoots a gun like that? Who throws the gun like that? Oh, man, that... <laughs> it's like a WWE table, chair, and trash can in this room. It's okay. It's, that's not okay for me to see. That's gonna live with me for a while. But you can't have that thing getting into other humans, other animals. I don't know if there's worms in the ground, if there's a mouse. They all gotta go. Watch, Clark. What? I said watch. Clark and watch him close. Do you hear me? Which one's Clark? The one with the dogs? Somebody in this camp ain't what he appears to be. Right now, that may be one or two of us. By spring, it could be all of us. Mm hmm. So, how do we know who's human? If I was an imitation, how would you know if it was really me? That's a good question. Yeah, I've been thinking about a blood serum test. What's that? Yeah, I explain. Could take a sample of each person's blood. Could mix it with uncontaminated blood. I suppose if there's a reaction, we'd know who isn't human. Yeah. Yeah. Keep an eye on Clark. He's close to that dog. Yeah. Yep, I was worried about Clark myself. We need Blair's help. He's the only one who knows what this organism is. He's too far gone, of. Fuse. But get the rest of his notebooks. Yeah, I mean, he just, like, took an axe to the whole place, killed off all your communication systems that you could possibly have had to get out of there, and you're like, hey, we need him. Yeah? Oh. Gary! Hey, you guys, come here! Someone did that on purpose. I mean, can they still do the blood thing if they all do, like, separate samples of blood, and then, like, somebody else puts their blood next to it and sees what happens, and then we narrowed it down to two? That would take a really long time, wouldn't it? All right, Doc, Gary and Clark, move over there, away from the others. Norris, you and Childs, shoot him up with morphine. Mac, I'm not a prisoner! <laughs> yeah, when a flamethrower is pointed at your face, take a step back. Oh no, would the, um, thing respond to, like, being... Let me, let me do it. You're gonna break the needle in my No, head. Doc. He's doing a real fine job. Yeah, that's a good point. But if, like, all of a sudden, Doc's like, no, not morphine! <laughs> oh my god, I would not be sitting with my back to a door like that. I'd be paranoid as hell just staring at the door in front of me and just never moving. Yeah, like that. See how paranoid he is? Oh. Remember the dog pen? How it lost light? Who's that? Oh, I don't want anything to happen to this guy. He's like our one hope for coming up with a way to detect who's who. Or who's what. No. Norris, you stay here. Any of them move, you fry them. You hear anything. Anything at all, you cut loose on the siren. We all meet back here in 20 minutes, regardless. And everybody watch whoever you're with. Real close. So the shirt being out there with McCready's name on it, that could just be like a decoy, right? 
I just really don't want it to be Kurt Russell. <laughs> he too pretty to be a thing. The thing. Blair, have you seen Fuchs? Oh God, is oh. I don't want to stay out here anymore. I want to come back inside. I'm not going to harm anybody, and there's nothing wrong with me. And if there was, I'm all better now. No, nope, I'd keep him out there. there. That's a noose, though, that's hanging right there. I'm all right. I'm much better. And I won't harm anybody. That's what something you gotta that, let like, me come back inside. But that's what somebody, something that wants to eat more people up would say. Step on it. Break its skull. Is it Dukes? Yeah. Why would it burn him? Maybe he burned himself before it could get to him. I don't think that's what happened. Where are we going? Up to my shack. What the hell for? Because when I left yesterday, I turned the lights off. Oh. Oh boy. Oh, there's so much tension. I feel it right here. Hey! All of you, come here! Oh, you okay? Oh no, is it you? Look, it was stashed in his own oil furnace. Wind must have dislodged it, but I don't think he saw me finding it. McCready? He's one of them. And Windows, where were you? In Palm Road, took it. Where were you? There's no window lights. Wait out. Okay, the guy does not trust Windows at all. Let's open it. Hell no. You think he's changed into one of those things? Uh huh. I don't know, gray sweater guy. Like he's been in pain. messes with me and the whole camp goes. Back off. Way off. I feel like McCready is getting set up because he's the one that's like really like with it running things. Where's the rest? <gasps> No, get away from him! Get away from him! I don't know. I don't think he had a heart attack. Clear! Clear! Yep! Ah! That was unexpected. He just got his arms on! Oh, that's fucked up. Somebody put Doc out of his misery, please. Get away from the spray! Get away from the spray! <sighs> Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Uh, totally reminds me of the 80s. Oh my gosh. Practical effects in the 80s were something, weren't they? Very, uh, total recall. Maybe light that and throw it on there? I don't know. It, Unless it's dynamite. I don't know if it's torches or if it's what it is. Ew. Uh, shoot it in the head. That's wild. Great effects. That head going across the floor like that. Thoroughly creepy. Spider legs! Ah! So can it like... Anything that it has taken over, like, can it just recreate that again? Imitate that? Well, that's messed up. His head's not even the right side up. That is messed up. I mean, uh, he wasted Norris pretty quick, didn't he? That's close enough, Clark. Yeah, Clark, yeah, back yeah. up. Then I'll have to kill you, child. Then kill me. Uh, uh... I mean it. Clark has that knife. Yes, you do. Or the scalpel. <laughs> oh, poor duck. 
We're gonna draw a little bit of everybody's blood. Because we're gonna find out who's the thing. Watching Norris in there gave me the idea that maybe every part of him was a whole. Every little piece was an individual animal with a built-in desire to protect its own life. My blood from one of you things won't obey when it's attacked. It'll try and survive. Mm -hmm. Crawl away from a hot needle. Does thing. that mean to like torture people? <laughs> That's scary. Really? Like that? Across the thumb? <sighs> they don't have like little needles to like prick your finger with? And if you might want to dip that in alcohol or put it in an autoclave or the tip of your thumb? Come on! Y'all just saw my Harry Potter pajama bottoms. <laughs> Windows, you're freaking me out, man. <laughs> Those things are full to the brim. <laughs> they didn't give that much blood. He, well, wouldn't you know? Or was he relieved because he actually is the thing? Yep. It's a crock of shit. Till you find one that, that reacts. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they've been infected. Uh huh. Wait. Well, Doc wasn't infected, yeah, but Clark. Clark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doc was just bit, chomped, eaten. This is pure nonsense. Doesn't prove a thing. Oh, I is it Gary? You were the only one that could have got to that blood. We'll do you last. <laughs> Who was that? Is this Palmer? What is it? Oh, oh no. Oh boy. Oh. Oh, they're all tied to the same chair. That's messed up. My windows! Windows! Come on! Well, nice knowing you, windows. That is insane. McCready, can you like run over and like pull the rope on the other guys so they can like help you? I mean, that definitely looked a little silly with him like being a body on the top there like obviously that was a dummy but it still got the point across <laughs> windows is still in there though well, mission accomplished let's let's go help those guys Oh, windows. Let's do it. Please don't be. Please don't be. <laughs> okay. Last is Gary. You guys still have to check Blair, too. They had reason to suspect you. Childs, we're going out to get Blair the test. Okay, good. He tries to make it good, back good, here, good. and we're not with him. Burn him. I like Childs, but it's mostly because I recognize the actor. <laughs> not by name, just by face and voice. <laughs> oh no, Blair is gone. How do you get out? Door was bolted from the outside. He's a thing. Uh, I don't know if I'd want to go down there. There? It's like a whole operation down there. They didn't know this tunnel was here? Hey Blair! You down there? We got something for you! I'm sure that would make Blair, like, happy. So like, I got something for you! Is he recreating a ship? What 
is it? Something he's been making. It's a ship of some kind. He stole the parts from the helicopter. Oh, that makes sense. Where was he trying to go? Home? Any place but here. I mean, Blair, like, insisting on going back inside would make me think that he also had been infected. I think I saw Charles outside the main entrance of the camp. What you doing outside? Oh, well, that's no good. Perfectly creepy. Yeah, no, that'll just add to it. Yeah, awesome, amazing. Six hours, it'll be a hundred below in here. He wants to freeze now. He's got no way out of here. Just wants to go to sleep in the cold until the rescue team finds it. Yep, wakes up, and then all is good. Whether we make it or not, we can't let the thing freeze again. You gotta burn it. Maybe we'll just warm things up a little around here. We're not getting out of here alive. Yeah, you gotta sacrifice. This is kind of the same thing that the other camp did, was burn everything and then tried to go after a dog that I thought was a cute little puppy. Oops. I mean, if anything, you guys are gonna end up freezing to death before it, like, gets frozen again, so you have to find it and kill it. I don't know if I'm watching like a remastered version of this, but this looks so good, like really crisp. I meant to say that a long time ago, but like with the blue and red lighting on McCready and then like all of this, it looks really, really good. Why would you walk into a dark area, Blair? Oh, Gary. Are they gonna know? Just pulled by his face. That was wild. Oh my gosh, I'm like so uncomfortable. I'm on like the edge of my seat, literally. Mm mm. Mm mm. Nope. Nope. That's not something I'd walk into. No, thank you. Bye, Nolans. How's it coming? It's an Allen's or Nulls. I think it's Nulls. I said, how's it? And there we are, McCready, the last. <laughs> ah! Great effect. Oh my gosh. Hit it, Pleasure! Oh. Oh, so what happened to that dynamite? Oh, can you start imitating somebody or something? Because I can't. A uh, dog and people? So does it like continually imitate like whatever it's absorbed? I mean, no, it didn't absorb it. That's a Doctor Who reference. And really, there's a Farscape reference for not knowing who is infected. I love sci-fi. I really do. Yeah, fuck you too! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> but where's Childs? We didn't see him get... Uh, absorbed, imitated... took up the whole camp. Well, except for the one guy that <laughs> McCready shot. <laughs> but he was gonna attack him with a scalpel. Not okay. R.I.P. Clark, but... <laughs> Fuck around, find out. <gasps> you the only one who made it? Not the only one. See you too. Did you kill it? Where were you, Charles? Yeah, I wouldn't trust it either. Thought I saw Blair. I went out after him. Got lost in the storm. Sure. 
I don't buy it either. I'm with McCready on this one. How will we make it? Maybe we won't. We yeah, 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 yeah. If you're worried about me. If we've got any surprises for each other, I don't think we're in much shape to do anything about it. Well, what do we do? Freeze. Well, we just wait here for a little while. See what happens. So do we have to wait till spring to find out what happened? That's how it is! Uh, you gotta be kidding. Wilford Brimley was Blair? I didn't recognize him without his mustache. I'm really interested to see who Clark was. Keith David. I can't tell you that I recognize that name. Richard Masser. I have no idea. Okay, no. I don't recognize any of these names other than Wilford Brimley. What if it's not the Wilford Brimley that I think it is? I do that a lot where I think one thing and it is incredibly incorrect. Based on the story, who goes there by John W. Campbell Jr. Okay, let's see. Where do I start? Um, no resolution. Could be frozen. People could have found it. Could be a thing somewhere else. The thing could be a thing somewhere else. <laughs> because we know McCready was fine at the end. Childs, on the other hand, we don't know that. Um, oh, you know what I was going to look up? Because I am so terrified of being wrong that I'm going to just look up Wilford Brimley. Let's look at his wiki. I mean, that looks like Blair. I'm so terrified to be like, yeah, the thing. Okay, Th that is, in fact, the Wilford Brimley because it said a Wilford Brimley. What? I, I can't tell you that I know him anything other than, like, the diabetes commercials. Um, and he's got, like, 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 this happening. Um, I don't know why I had to do that. I just was like, oh my god. I didn't realize he was an actual actor, and he was really good. He was really good. But definitely as soon as Blair was, like, asking to come back inside... I wasn't buying it for a second. I was like, no, that's something that a thing that like wants to eat other people. I don't know what it was doing, like joining, absorbing, infecting. But I will say that that 80s special effects was in full effect and it was fantastic. The only thing that like really took me out of it was um, I'm trying to think, was it Palmer? Who then grabbed windows and then like windows was like getting like eaten and like he was kicking and flailing like it was obvious that it was a dummy that somebody was doing that with that's the only time that it really took me out of it but like all of the other stuff like that model work and just like the face is frozen and everything a twisted mind came up with that and it's amazing simply amazing now i feel like a complete jackass for just being like stop shooting at the puppy this is probably a dumb billionaire who's like out game hunting or you know like whatever and mm, mm, sorry i have to apologize to the norwegians that were in the helicopter <laughs> i was like I, mm -mm, you don't do that. I am a white lady who loves animals. I will come after you. And now I feel bad. <laughs> and you know what's like kind of the thing that was like really throwing me off was that it was a very well-behaved dog. <laughs> like it wasn't like, you know, bringing you a tennis ball and then like barking and then like, you know, whatever, uh, like eating food that's like on the table or whatever. And like, I don't know how each individual was infected. But like, I thought for sure Clark would have been after spending that much time with the dog and then come to find out Clark was fine. Um, but who was the first guy? Bennings? With the red hair? Yeah, I think it was Bennings. Um, yeah, like, when the dog walked past me, it's like, ah! Like, I was just like, did he just get bit? Did he, like, you know, graze his bullet wound? Which I thought he got shot in the leg and he got grazed. He got shot at. 
Apparently grazes heal <laughs> very quickly these days. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, I, I agree. Destroy the whole place, burn it all down. Nothing needs to survive. Um, but if MacReady, which we know MacReady was not infected and Childs was, and then MacReady dies and Childs freezes, then that means that it's still alive, right? I don't know. What a great story. Um, I, I absolutely love the special effects. Um, it was very grotesque. The creepiest thing, obviously, was the spider. I don't do spiders and I don't do clowns. A spider clown is absolutely my worst nightmare. But uh, yeah, I, I definitely found it thoroughly creepy, especially when it was like the first time we see it, like it demogorgoned and then it had like spindly things coming out and shooting around and spraying the dogs with its juices. And oh, oh, I felt bad for Clark because Clark was devastated about the dogs. He really was. And, and I mean, I get it. So was I, but I was just like, well, now that we know that this thing is here, Oops. Um, yeah. Wild. What a good movie. What a good movie. And, and this was in like 1982. It had perfect suspense. The lighting was fantastic, especially like that shot with like Mac with the blue light on him. And then he's got the flare. Like it looked perfect. And like I said, I don't know if this has been remastered, but it looked beautiful. It looked really, really good. So I, I feel like it's been cleaned up specifically. It still had old timey, like kind of like pacing and stuff like that, where it's like, there's like a lot of dialogue and like pauses and like looks and like the shots look like they lingered and took a little bit longer. And where I appreciate that kind of stuff, but I I also kind of notice it now and it takes me out and that's just because of the age of the film like having like the credits at the beginning of the, that is not a knock on the film at all but um those are just those things that can sometimes like show its age and it just reminds me but i'll tell you like watching the effects and with the like the lighting and even some of the music most of the time like the heartbeat kind of beat that you could hear like that was phenomenal that was phenomenal like this movie could have been made yesterday you know, like it looked fantastic. I really, really, really enjoyed this. This was picked by my Patreon members. So if you want to watch the full length reaction to this in a watch along format where you do need your own copy, you can head over to Patreon for that and you can vote on the next thing that I'm going to watch. And definitely for Halloween time, uh, I am the biggest wuss on the planet. And uh, it, 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 I, I absolutely love the Saw movies. So that tells you like, how things have shifted. Um, so if there's other recommendations that you have, you can leave them down below in the comments. You can head over to Patreon if you would like, but just remember to like, subscribe, and comment because it does help the algorithm. So this pushes it out to more people who then sees this. So then you can watch me watch other things. Like I think uh, the second highest thing on the Patreon poll was Event Horizon, um, which I do believe takes place in space, and The Mist, and I'm trying to think of was it <laughs> probably should have looked at that before I jumped on here but there was a lot of other good movies that were ranked really really high on the list but far and wide the thing won it like there was no debate that this was going to be the movie that I was going to watch so if you do want to watch that head on over to the Patreon if not come back here for the next thing that I'm going to watch uh it's Halloween time currently right now if you're watching this six months from now, go watch the other stuff that came out for Halloween and then watch the other stuff that I watched because it's all a good time when you come here and, you know, I do my best to give you the goods. So guys, come back here for the next movie or television show or trailer reaction. I'm here for you for all your needs. Well, reaction needs. Okay. <laughs> I made it weird. I gotta go. Bye.